Hey guys, welcome to the channel. This is Hindu Jr. And this is another Let's Play of Pokemon XD Gale of Darkness. Now, been a little bit of work off camera. I got everyone to 48. I even have my wall ring now. Yay. Um, and if you've watched the last episode, you, if you haven't, you really should take a look. The big, long list of episodes. It's all in a playlist that I've got off to the side. Just look up uh, Pokemon XD Let's Play. But, uh, basically, uh, the opponents that I was dealing with were over my level. So, yeah, I couldn't really deal with that for much longer. I figured it was about time I finally, you know, leveled everyone up. There's also a little bit of a shift in how I have things set up. Uh, now everyone has a held item. For those of you that don't remember, I'll go ahead and review it now. So, hop in here. So, Zaprong's got Magnet, which in this game, it amplifies electric moves. Very nice. It's helpful. I mean, I could probably give it something else that's a little more useful, like Never Melt Ice or something to that effect, but... Eh, I think, I think boosting the thunder will help some. Wolverine has the Never Melt Ice to boost its Ice Beam. Claydol has Macho Brace, which boosts growth and drops speed. It, I think it's my slowest Mon on my team, so I'm not too worried about that. 99? Oh, well. Wolverine's actually slower. How about that? Eh, whatever. Breloom is holding the Miracle Seed to boost its uh, Mega Drain, because it is not a special attacker, and Grass is still, technically speaking, a special move. So, yeah. Fun stuff. I don't have any problems with Headbutt or Brick Break, because of that attack power, but compared to that special attack power, the Mega Drain can't do crap, so Miracle Seed. Umbreon is the shift here. I gave Umbreon the leftovers instead of the black gla the sunglasses because Umbreon is one of my tankiest mons. I think the only one more tanky is Claydol. And not by a whole lot. Umbreon is more special def has way more special defense than Claydol does and it has more health. Their physical defense is just about the same, though. But, yeah. So, I gave Umbreon the leftovers, so he can tank things a little easier. And then I gave Crobat the black glasses. Because... Wing attack is stab, so I don't really need to worry about that. Uh, I plan on trading out Air Cutter for Poison Fang, if it ever learns it. I think it does. It's just way later down the line. Let me take a hot look here real quick. Back in the back. Dang it. I keep losing it. There we are. Yeah, so it is a level away. One level, and it will learn Poison Fang. And I plan on swapping out Air Cutter for that, because Confuse Ray is too useful. And Air Cutter is shit. Um, doesn't have nearly the amount of power that it ought to have. For what it's got, it's just, it's not worth it. Especially for attacking both enemies on the other side of the field. It's just not worth it. So, I'm going to teach it Poison Fang. And that should do it. And then Black, so Poison Fang and Aerial Ace, or Wing Attack... Uh, have stab and bite does not. So, black sunglasses boost that up a little bit. Should balance things out a little bit. 
it's been a nice setup, so hopefully this will help me to get through the game a little better. We'll see. And yes, now I can use this to go up and down, so I don't need to go through the entire hideout just to heal up. So, makes that nice. Alright, yep. So, now we hop into the big sphere thing sitting in the... Uh, I'd see no support for that whatsoever. I don't see how they can have such a heavy looking area hanging there, but okay. Whatever. It's a video game. I guess they can do whatever the hell they want. Oh, that's that's useful. That would have been nice to know sooner. Alright, so a few other things. While I was training, a few more mons have been purified, if you will. They're like a step away. Only one that hasn't yet is Munch or Snorlax. So, I'm not going to bother moving them around quite yet. I want to I'm going to just swap them out when I catch the Shadow Mons that i got to work on. So, this is actually... I think this is the most Shadow Mons I've had at once cleared out. Usually, it doesn't pan out quite this well. Because, you know, I don't dilly-dally a lot. I plow right through and have no problems. My Mons are in good shape, so I shouldn't need to worry about that. I actually don't even need the elevator anymore. I have that, so... Yeah, hi there, Greville. Oh, oh, oh. Now this is quite a surprise. You managed to defeat Ar Ardos. Of course, you have also beaten so many of my followers. Perhaps it's no surprise that you won. I must say that I haven't been this excited in a long time. I do have an appreciation for the strong, you see. However, I also cannot allow your interference. My Shadow Pokemon plan is nearing, nearing completion. You sure about that? I've literally caught just about every Shadow Mon you've ever released. So, I mean, the only ones that I haven't caught yet are the ones you the redhead and maybe a few others have and that's about it so I don't know what you're expecting but whatever oh that's just creepy so for the time being I think I will have you securely out of the way right where you are now Cool. Alright, so I now have access here, which speeds things up quite a bit for me. I don't have to... I don't even have to go that far for all of that. That's good to know. Okay, I was half expecting an admin to come out of nowhere. There are no hidden items in this entire setup, is there? The elevator won't open. Really? I don't know what to do then. Uh, what? Huh. I do not remember. Oh, crap. Okay. Um, yay. Hmm. Ah. Oh god, Gorgian. Oh no. I don't like Gorgian. I can't tell you how many times I've failed to deal with Gorgian just because of his earthquake specific team. It is BS. Oh. <sighs> it's me again, kid. You know, it makes me kind of happy to see you, since I I've seen you so often. But the way you keep beating me, my cred's taking a beating. Aye. 
So, Master Greville gave me this one last chance to redeem myself, but this is it. If I lose this one, there's no tomorrow. Here goes. Mm. I love high shoes. They're a great snack. Mm. Bought a pack of them off of Amazon. Pretty good. It's just a pack of six three ounce bags. All uh, varying flavors. Freaking love it. Alright. Mm. Ah, shit. There. Damn. Okay. I didn't realize it had that. Well, here's hoping bite kicks in. Brick break. Really? Oh. Oh, you're actually smart. Uh oh. Oh, and then it used earthquake. Great. Well, didn't really do a whole lot to Umbreon. Didn't do a whole lot to Ursaring either, though. It's not exactly a physical fighter, so I'm kind of surprised he would bother to put Earthquake on that thing. Alright, so... Um... You know what? Just do Double Bite on Slowking. Screw it. If Ursaring does Earthquake, it'll probably take out Slowking if the Bites don't, which the Bites will, so... The next Mon will just end up taking serious Earthquake damage if he does Earthquake on Worst Ring. I'm pretty sure he will. He likes to go back and forth with that, so... Yay, Umbreon's level 49. 4 to Special Defense. 3 to Health. 2 to Defense and Speed. And 1 to Special Attack and Physical Attack. Jeez. All right then. Oh, Agron, that's a bad choice. Uh, I see, Earthring doesn't have Earthquake. That's a possibility. All right, now Agron is going to be a pain. It's steel and rock and it resists dark, so it's not really gonna do me a whole lot of good. Let's do wing attack on Ursaring and have Umbreon swap out. Swap out for Claydol, maybe? What does Claydol got? Yeah, let's go Claydol. Mm. Yeah, because Breloom... And Zaprong would just be absolutely wiped, and Wolverine doesn't really have anything for Agron either, so yeah, we'll do this. <laughs> nice. Good hit there, Crobat. <laughs> oh, Iron Tail. See, I wasn't expecting that one. All right. I'll do Earthquake. Because <laughs> I can. <laughs> there goes Ursaring. Ah. Oh. Crobat is just refusing to get to that level. Oh, you might have made a mistake. Earthquake. <laughs> oh, this is gonna hurt you. Agron takes... Uh, Agron's out. <laughs> Alright, that works. I might, have made a, I might have made a mistake. Oh, critical hit. Wolverine is pretty much screwed over. Crobat's level 49. 
Three to health, two to everything else. Very nice. Poison Fang! Yeah! Alright, let's drop Air Cutter. Yay, Poison Fang! Would you quit it, you stupid game? What the hell? Oh god. It can't seem to decide whether it wants standard screen or widescreen. Oh, that's Shadow. Yep. Oh boy, Polyrath is gonna... Polyrath is gonna hurt. Mm, do I do wing attack? I don't think so. I think that would take it out. Let's do Confuse Ray on Polyrath. Ancient power on Walrein. Because I can and I want to. Just take out Walrein. I'll deal with the two shadows. Screw it. Damn! Shadow Sky. That's that's gonna hurt. Oh, and then it does Ice Beam. Yay. Oh, bye, Crobat. Oh! Good job holding on, Crobat. Holy crap. Bye, Wolverine. Not my Wolverine, his Wolverine. Alright, what's your other, other shadow there? Mr. Mime. That's disturbing. All right, cool. Yay. And my team's gonna be the only one taking damage from that. So, Crobat's not gonna survive another couple turns. It might live through this turn, but I don't think it's gonna make it to the next. So, I'm... Mm. Yeah, it's probably going to take one of them out, but I'm going to use the super effective moves. Yeah, alright, that works. I'm okay with that. Oh, Shadow Storm. Yep, bye Crobat. Good job holding on, though. He lasted long enough to weaken one of them, so that's all I can really ask for. And Claydol ain't going down easy. I can send out Umbreon real quick. Nice! Keep hurting yourself there, Polyrath. And then Psychic. I think Claydol's weak enough, it shouldn't kill it. Yes! Nice! That could not have been a better setup. So, Umbreon's leftovers, I think, is going to cancel out damage. Oh, no, it's a little more. It's a little more than what it does. All right, that's not bad. All right, so I think I'll go Confuse Ray on Mr. Mime. And I think I'm going to use an Ultra Ball on Polyrath. It's weakened. This is my best chance. I would like to paralyze it, but I don't think that's going to happen. I'm just going to have to hope it doesn't knock itself out with confusion. That's the one problem with using confusion. Yeah, that's not going to do major damage. It does do some damage, but... Ooh. Claydol, what the heck? Oh, snapped out of confusion. Alright, Shadow Rush. Oh no, that's a... Recoil? Nope, doesn't look like it. Okay. Alright, um... Let's bring out Breloom. Both of them have attacked, so... I shouldn't have to worry too much. I can at least paralyze one. Mm 
All right, so I think so. I'm gonna throw the Ultra Ball at Polyrath, and I think I want to stun Spore Mister Mime only because I I have not seen a physical move come from it yet, and I can just send out Zaprong and bait Polyrath to attack it to get paralyzed. Or it could just get caught. That's cool too. Works for me. Damn. I was hoping it would hurt itself in confusion. This is the one time I really needed it. Because it's gonna it's gonna hurt for Breloom. Yeah. Uh-huh. This is why I decided to... Ah, are you kidding me? Breloom! That was your one chance. God damn it. Alright, um... Uh, damn it. Alright, I'm just gonna throw an Ultra Ball and hope to God that I can catch it. Because otherwise I gotta hope that it hurts itself in confusion and gives me a second chance at paralyzing it. Because frickin' Breloom had to go and fuck that up. That works, I guess. Uh, okay. I threatened to paralyze them and they both were like, yep, nope, we're, uh, we're conceding. Jeez. Grah! We're doomed! That's a little overkill. Just saying. I honestly did not expect to actually win that. Not as easy, not as well as I did, anyway. Blech. That was the very last chance Master Greville gave me. How could I keep losing to some kid over and over? He lost to me twice. You're acting like you've lost to me like seven times in a row now. <laughs> if there were a tree, I'd climb it to get away from all this. Yeah, okay. I don't really care. I'm gonna go and heal my mons. And rearrange some shadows. Alright. Let's see, what do we got? What do we got? Not a whole lot of options here from the looks of it. I mean, I can go with just about any of them, but none of them are giving me that uh, setup. The one I really want. Yeah. Alright. I think that's the... Yeah. Jeez. Oh, yeah. There you go. That works. All right, that should do it for this. All right, and then yeah, that should work. So, now we should be able to use that. Yay! Okay, then. Oh, well, there's another fight. Cool. Yep, should be good. Let's hop in. 
You won't quite... You won't quit being a pest, will you? I mean, I've taken down three of your adamans so far. You really want to fight me? You're a fucking peon. You're nothing compared to them. Mm-hmm. Glalian Amphros, huh? Alrighty then. As long as that Glalie isn't too fast, Breloom should be able to knock it out real quick. And I'll just do strong attack on Amphros. Bye. Like I said, doesn't take much. Oh, hi, Breloom. Cotton Spore. Oh, boy. I don't think that's really going to help you too much, but okay. That yeah, Wolverine was already the slowest Mon on the field. Well, mm, actually, no, it went faster than you. That's kind of sad. Alright, um... I want to do Mega Drain on Amphros, just because I don't want to touch it and get hit with static. So, I'll do that. However, Wolverine can do Ice Beam on Breloom. Their Breloom. Oh, tightened up its focus. Okay. That works. Cotton Spore again? Ah. And... Bye, Breloom. Nice. <laughs> Both of my Mons have taken one out of their own accord. I'm A-OK -okay with this. Ooh, Dawn Fan. That a Shadow? No. Okay. I don't know why it would be. I caught a wild fampy earlier, so it wouldn't make any sense to have a sh shadow dawn fan. Alright, so I'm going to do Mega Drain on Amphros. Dawn fan is a ground? Pure ground? Let's do Water Pulse. I suppose I probably could have done Ice Beam, but I'm not entirely positive that that is super effective against ground. More than likely it is, but I went with a safe bet, so it's whatever. Doug Trio, that's the shadow. Alright. Oh boy, that's gonna be fun. Roll out. At least you didn't do Defense Curl first, that would have really mess some shit up. Now the problem with Doug Trio is it is very much a glass cannon. If I so much as touch this thing, it's going to die. So I need to swap out for a Mon that is not that strong. Let's go with Umbreon. Mm. Yeah, let's go with Umbreon. And then Wolverine. Let's just ru oh, waste a turn with Snore. Screw it. It's not like I'm going to lose anything by doing that. Shadow Sky. Yay. Alright, so... Yeah, Shadow Sky just got cancelled out for Umbreon. Uh, that works for me. Let's see... Do I go Bite, or do I go Quick Attack? Let's go Quick Attack. I don't want the stab taking... I don't want to use a stab attack and end up taking out a Doug Trio. Um... Oh, you know what? I could have kept Breloom in. 
Eh, we can swap him in. I want to paralyze this thing, too. I, that's what I should have done with Breloom, and then swapped out Walrein for Umbreon, but it is what it is. Ooh, yeah. Let's, let's use Quick Attack for now. Oh, Shadow Break, that's... Yeah, that kind of hurts. At least there's no recoil. I'm pretty sure there's at least one or two that are... That have recoil, so... Okay, come on. Don't, don't die on me now. Thank you. Freaking controller deciding when it wants to work. Piece of crap. Alright, Stun Spore on Dugtrio. Ooh, yeah, I think that might be good. If I do another tackle on I end, or quick attack. Oh, are you kidding me? Of course Breloom would freaking faint before I could freaking... Mm, I'm sending out Zap wrong. I'm going to bait it to... Hopefully it attacks Zap prong and paralyzes itself, but can't really bet on anything anymore. <sighs> Trying to freaking paralyze the damn thing so I can catch it a little easier. Piece of shit. Um, I should have used Confuse Ray, but oh well, whatever. Go ahead and throw an Ultra Ball. Who knows, maybe I'll get lucky enough and just catch it on the spot. Yeah, I didn't think so. Shadow Break. Ouch. Damn it, really? Couldn't have paralyzed the damn thing? No, it's confused at least. Not like that's gonna make a difference. I've seen plenty of times where I've confused and paralyzed something and it hit like five times in a freaking row. It's probably happened on this series somewhere, so what can I say? Um Yeah, let's just go with Confuse Ray again. Cause it's not like I have much of a choice otherwise. <clears throat> Okay, apparently the first Ultra Ball in a fight battle has to fail, and then every last one otherwise succeeds. I don't get it. I don't. Gah, this isn't happening. It's not real. Oh, it's real, all right. It's very real. All right, I think that'll do it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please like, subscribe, all that good YouTuber stuff. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye.